So let's bring him on. Yeah, let's do it. Mr. Corey J. Wozniak. <laughs> Ooh, we, got, we got clapping going on. Yes. Here. Round of applause. I'm not standing, though. I got to go. Okay, bye. I'm, get, I'm being replaced. You are. Let's get him in here. My, my other favorite person. <laughs> We're not doing it right now, are we? Yeah, you're getting yeah, the you're fuck you're on in. right now. Get in there. What do you mean, get are we there, not so doing I'm it right now? No, you got to get in. You're getting in here. Wait, wait. I do want to, like, ha like say hi to her before she just comes yeah, and yeah, sits in this all, chair. Yeah, Sit down. You hear what I'm saying, Kev? Yeah, sit down okay. like we're going into it. Get in there. All right. Pull that mic to you. Say hello. Hello, everyone. Yeah. Well, I was just going to give you a moment. Oh. All right, everybody. Mr. Wozniak is in the motherfucking building. Here we are, you know, they call me up uh, every time a podcast or something like this wants to uh, go trending, they <laughs> call me up. I do this stuff all the yeah, time. This is our superstar, you know, actually. I do this, this is for our prize possession. Mall signings. Uh, yeah. I got 800 Instagram followers. He'll but sign some titties for you, yeah. some baby faces. Exactly. But they're loyal followers. <laughs> I'll, take a, I'll take a hard 800 over an easy... Two million any day of the week. Right, Ty? <laughs> yeah, totally. <laughs> all right, guys. Those so robots that follow all... All right, never mind. <laughs> <laughs> I can't. Okay, okay. Let's get into the next part of the show. We are going to intro Bree, <laughs> who's going to come on and talk some shit about Kevin, hopefully. So let's see. Here we see go. I've been waiting <laughs> for this. Happens. Okay, come on in. I know we need our clappy thing. I can't reach it. It's the yellow one. There yeah. we go. There we go. Yeah. Perfect. Oh, that's cool. Bree, okay, you look uh, stunning, you as too. always. Yeah, loving the beachy theme we all got going. Yeah. Proud of you guys. Right. Thanks for I'm showing out for us. Yes, yes. Kevin made me spend $200. Just kidding. Made me yeah. spend money buying outfits so <laughs> I could fit this theme. So yeah. glad you guys could uh, figure it out. Yeah. You know, uh, I wore black, so I, I don't... Uh, Fuck with your color scheme. Yes. Right? Okay. Yeah. You heard that, right? <laughs> yeah. Okay. I can't wait to yeah. talk to her about it. Yeah. Okay. Cool. Let's get into it. So tell us about um, your date with Kevin. Like, how did he ask you? Like, let's just start getting into all the nitty gritty oh. stuff. Um, he called me Friday night. Okay. He uh, called. Okay. Yeah. So and he proud. Okay. Called me Friday night. Um, I was out downtown doing First Friday. Ooh. Um had it already we were like a whole group of us were meeting down there um and <laughs> to get off phone i was like why don't you just come down to downtown and meet meet me here yeah um so he came to downtown um uh, met a oh, lot of he people. didn't give us this story yeah, i didn't hear any of that we didn't get any of this okay i got the cool guy version of that yeah <laughs> wow yeah so he uh he came downtown i was pretty shocked too because we haven't hung out like that in um, years. Yeah. Um, so it was a little <laughs> out of the blue. Yeah. And he met all, like, the people I work with, um, my boss, wow. which is one of my best friends. Yeah. Um, and, yeah. Okay, fun. Okay, okay. Wait, that wait, was wait, wait, way wait. more we, than we he gotta, told us. I, I, we got to get into the back story here before she brought up the way back. So uh, so both of these yeah, girls. The yeah, both of these girls are Red Rocks pool's finest to ever work there <laughs> i gotta give props to danny and a-rod for just finding I, did he hire did, who hired you guys a -Rod. Danny. Boom. A -Rod, yeah. man that's a tandem right there like look <laughs> at because to be honest and you guys only got better looking you know that's not yeah, god that was six years ago that yeah. red rock what pool is always like the the minor leagues t to go on to the strip and make yeah. a lot of money you know and what a great i mean you can't beat the ultimate blonde and the ultimate brunette here <laughs> And I remember, and I'll go back in time, but I remember uh, me and Kevin uh, walking into the pool, and uh, Bree was behind the bar. And uh, I, I remember we we're like, oh, she likes Drake. She's going to love you, because everybody was calling him Drake at the time. And he had, <laughs> and he, uh, he went as Drake for Halloween in the wheelchair and all yeah, that stuff. Yeah, yeah. So we're like, oh, we're going to set them up. It's going to be great. And then he was like, tech, he was telling me, like, off camera or off off premises he was like hey i'm going to uh ask her out or whatever and then <laughs> and then i was like i remember i ran into brie again at cosmo 
And I said, hey, whatever And this happened? was a young Kevin, too. Like, let's young also Kevin. keep this in mind. Young, young Kevin. Kevin is a different Kevin. No, yeah. The, I none mean, of this stuff. on top of us being different, but yeah. him, too, yeah, especially. Yeah, this is like 2014. 2014. Damn. What a throwback. 2014. And, uh, yeah, so I remember talking to Bree, and I said, hey, did that kid ever text you? And she's like, yeah, you know, it's... I mean, you know, he's, he's not funny. <laughs> <laughs> he's not funny enough. And I remember being like, oh, shit. Oh, I love it. Maybe he isn't. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. Maybe he's not funny Cause enough. Because you guys were newly friends then, too, yeah? Well, kind of, yeah. We, yeah. I knew who he was, and we were kind of hanging around, but not really. Yeah. And, uh, yeah. Yeah, she's like, it's not funny. I don't know if it was coming back from that. So, to me, I take that as she's not into it at all. Yeah. And then, he, yeah, he tells me the story about him coming alone to ask you on a date. I wasn't there for that. And I guess it went terribly wrong. <laughs> and, it went uh, terribly, terribly yeah. wrong. <laughs> he told me it went great. So I was like, oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. let's hear what happened that day. Um, yeah, so he came to the pool. It was slow. Um, I had just turned 21, so I was bar backing by myself. And Oof. he walks up, and <laughs> he's <laughs> by himself, which I thought was a little odd. I was like, oh, hey, what's up? How what are a fucking you? weirdo. I'm dead. Okay. <laughs> And that at the he's time, I'm like literally he's dying picturing him. young Kev do this. At the time, uh, this I was talking to someone at the pool, and yeah. he was very he was very near. And so Kevin comes up and he's like, "Hey, like I, I'd love to take you on a date." Like, and I see Kevin's eyes like following someone, and then that dude just pacing back and forth, back and forth. And he's like, "Oh, it's it's fine, it's fine. You know, I want to take you to sushi. Like, let's go to sushi." And I knew he, he was like really close friends with uh, Danny and all them, so I'm like, oh man, like I'm I don't I don't know what to say, like uh, yeah, I don't know what to do. I'm like, oh man, and it was very new that I was like just like started talking to this guy um, who worked there, and and so I was like, oh, okay, yeah, like oh yeah, I'll give you my number, sure, it's fine, like we'll like link up, whatever, and then um, yeah, he, I guess he hadn't been on a date since since that. <laughs> yep, yeah, yeah, he doesn't go on dates. <laughs> he doesn't Only, go on dates. Yeah. I but told you he tricked me. I thought I was taking. But every me guy, out. I feel like, yeah. says that. So it's like, in yeah. my no, head, Kevin like, literally yeah, doesn't, know. though. Yeah. Sadly, too, the girls like don't demand it anymore. They're just yeah, like coming over true. for Netflix nights or whatever they're doing. Yeah. Or or haunted. As houses. much as Kevin's <laughs> non-committal, like most of the girls are non-committal. I feel like. Yep. Mm-hmm. Okay. Yep. Okay. Let's get back to the date. I yep. want to hear more. Yep. Uh, okay. So so you say yes. So okay. So fast forward to the day of the date. <laughs> So then the date comes, he's texting me, which we've probably texted more in the past 48 hours than I think in general. Yeah. And I was like, this is weird. This is odd, but okay, whatever. You know, maybe yeah. he thinks he's making sure that I'm not going to bail. Yeah. Um, picks me up. He's like, okay, it's 730. Mind you, I completely forgot. Like I, Friday, I took a break from drinking because my birthday is in yeah, um, July. Yeah. So yeah. for June, I was like, all right, you know, I'm going to get ready. So I got, I was pretty, I completely, for, I didn't, he had to remind me. I was like, wait, we're going on a date. You're like, oh yeah, fuck. Um, he was like 730. Yeah. Uh, arrives late. Yes. Oof. Late. Yes. Is that a big turn off when you arrived late? She, late. He fucking knew you were going to say this and I was like, late. perfect. <laughs> okay. He was late. Also, can we discuss his outfit? He had. What were your impression on it? Yeah. It didn't match. Thank you. But I wasn't. <laughs> I was like, okay, maybe it's the 4th of July. He wanted, needed to wear, like, a blue shirt. I'm dead. I'm <laughs> fucking dead. Literally, uh, he, I'm like, he tells me your outfit. I'm like, cool, love it. And then I was like, okay, so what were you wearing? He's like, he literally goes, well, you'll just see it. The way he answers it, and immediately I was like, what what the fuck are you talking about? That's what the fuck you wore. I was like, why would you wear green and blue? It, it didn't match. No, I'm like, Kevin, did he, did he lose black points is for always. You're like, this guy can't even fucking dress himself. No, because normally he can. Oh, okay. It, it's very Semi. odd that he wore that it is. to me. So I was like, okay, first of all, just in the future, just black is always a safe bet because a girl can wear any color, but if you're wearing black, you guys aren't going to clash. Yeah. And it'll be fine. I was like, blue and green, it, not fucking it. Uh-uh. No. no. I, I, I mean, it was for July. I was in black, a black dress and pink heels. Yeah, that's cute. Oof. I was like, hey, I'm liking that. <laughs> and I'm like, Kevin, what the fuck? You dropped the ball. Okay, no, yeah. continue. He definitely um, did not match whatsoever. Um, yeah. But I wasn't mad at it. I was like, okay, all right. But you like thought it was for the holiday, which yeah. I guess, yeah, is an angle to think of. 
But I'm just like, what the fuck are you wearing? It was kind of funny, yeah. uh, just because like I'm I'm a cookie person. Like I love, absolutely love cookies. Like no matter yeah. where I go, I always like stop at. I just love them, and yeah. so it was cute because like I I come up, and I see this little Oreos on the uh, driver or the passenger seat. But he wanted, he was so persistent on opening the door that he <laughs> locked the door, so you yeah. couldn't open it. But. Neither could he. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> it took Stop. him three times of, wait, hold on, hold on, running back around the car, trying oh, to unlock it. This no. detail. Is this his car? Was this your car? He's right his around. car. Oh, his. his car. Yes. And he couldn't operate his own fucking car. Because <laughs> my biggest thing is, if I'm in, the, I told, I said it earlier, I was like, if I'm in the presence of a man, I, if I have to touch a door, I'm pissed. Like, I shouldn't be touching a door. And he's like, yeah, well, I was thinking of that, and I was trying not to you know fuck it up and i wanted to open the door and do it the right way he's like but then i couldn't get the fucking car door to open and i was like oh my god what it took him like three times he's like oh wait 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 and then he was like don't okay i'm gonna unlock it but you don't are not touch allowed it. to touch the door yeah hold on after you madam And so I was like, okay, I just want to get in the car. Like, <laughs> Yeah, you're like, I'm over it. Okay. Um, and then we went to, oh, man, I forgot the place we went to. It's okay. I forgot the name. But it was, I, I hadn't been there. He tried tricking me. Um, he, like, had to, oh, he, he almost died. Yeah. Yeah, <laughs> almost gotten two different. Um, he hit the sidewalk turning in and then <laughs> yes oh, like i'm living for this oh my god yes okay so then he didn't mention that one either yeah that was good okay. and then when he was he was trying to trick me uh a car slammed in front of him and almost caused like this whole accident yeah and that was like two minutes before he almost he got on the curb yeah um walked in it was a great conversation. It wasn't, like, goofy. It wasn't, like, him trying too hard, trying yeah. to, like, you know, have this in his head. Because he gets in his head, when, especially like when it's something about his passion and something like that. Yeah. Didn't get into in his head. Wasn't too nervous. It was actually fun. Um, like, I forgot we were on a date and, like, yeah. it had to do with this podcast. And then we sat down and he ordered... He ordered something he never orders, like this cold, like bougie drink. That's yeah, the waiter, like you know, that's what he said. But it was still bourbon, so I was like, okay, that's still. Was he uh, was he throwing money around? Like yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, he he tipped the person <laughs> when we walked in. Um, I saw that, and I was, was that like, impressive, or were you like, uh, this is, uh, or were you like, uh, uh, this trying to show off, or did you like uh, that he actually was hooking them up? I like that you was hooking him up because it's like I've been like you know working in the yeah. industry and you always have to take care of people, especially if they're yeah. doing you favors, regardless yeah. if you know them. But so I liked that, and then he, it, but he was being a goofball about it, like <laughs> being all yeah. secretive, like hey, thank you, everyone, you know, <laughs> yeah, trying yeah. to be all secretive, and I was like, okay, whatever. There you go. 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 Oh, I get like cool guy in it. So. Yeah. yeah. And then, um, no, it was fun. It was fun. Besides all that, everything was pretty smooth. Then, uh, you know, but he was ordering so much food. Yeah. Like, he wanted the Caesar salad. He wanted, and I was like, oh, man, like, and I don't eat cheese. And that's always awkward when you're on a date and you're like, and they're like, oh, we're going to share it. And it's like, oh, I mean, I hate to tell you this, but like, I'm not going to eat it if it has yeah. cheese, regardless. So, um, he ordered the Caesar salad after we had already ordered like three sides. I ordered salmon. He ordered a whole pork, like a whole, I don't even know what it was called. <laughs> and then dessert comes and he's like, you want dessert? And I was like, I mean, I I'm full. How can you <laughs> yeah, fit like, any more food? What the hell? Yeah. Are you sure there's nothing else I can bring you? Do you want another Coke? Um, okay. Two more Cokes? And I didn't realize, I was like, why is he like stalling? He was, he mm -hmm. was stalling a lot. Mm -hmm. um, 
And then when we were leaving, then he asked about the back room that the mob used to sit in. And then we went toward it. And I was like, you're really like trying to like extend this as long as possible. And I didn't understand at first. Yeah. I, I was like, okay, this is a little weird. Whatever. Interesting. Interesting. Okay. So we went there. This is so fun. I'm like living <laughs> for the fact that we get two sides of the story because yeah. it's so much more fun. Okay. Keep going. Yeah. Oh, I'm curious what he Oh said. my God. This is so <laughs> great. Okay. Keep going. Um, and... Then I'm thinking he's taking me home. Mm -hmm. um, we're blasting music. He's uh, my sister used to be obsessed with like Blink 182, so he was actually shocked that I knew these songs that he was playing. Cause mm -hmm. I'm not into rock. And um, then all of a sudden, and then he mentioned the fireworks. Like it was like a a practice of the fireworks. Like, and I was like, oh my gosh, like, in the back of my head, I was like, man, you're gonna probably gonna get to see, like, you would have gotten an A if you tied in the fireworks, 4th of July. Yeah. I was like, oof, oof. Ooh, yeah. It was going bad till oof. then, I like it, I heard that. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, it would have been good. Um, And then he goes routes that I've never se seen. Like, he took routes that were totally- Like back routes. Yes, like yeah. totally flew, like, I thought we were going back, he was dropping me off at my house. Um. And he, then all of a sudden, we're going to the Morea parking, or not Morea, sorry, Mandalay Bay yeah. parking garage. <laughs> and we go all the way to the top floor, and I was like, oh, my God. And then he mentioned, he was like, oh, fireworks start in seven minutes. And we go to the top, and we get there probably a minute before the fireworks start. So it was like perfect timing, perfect yeah. time. Um, and it's like the perfect view, too. Yes. It was a perfect view. I'm like super big on views. Yeah. And fireworks. And I was like in a daze. I was just like, oh my God, I have never had a 4th of July like this where you see these type of fireworks like yeah. this. Um, Cause you can see the rest of the valley from up there too. So you kind yeah. of get literally all of them because there were so many going on. Yeah, there was like a video even that he got. Um, and it was really, really good. Yeah. It, it just looked great. It was put together great. Um, all in all, I was surprised at how much effort he put into that. Yeah. Like, you could tell a lot of effort went into it, a lot yeah. of planning. And I was like, that was I surprisingly was great. Yeah. yeah. That okay, was so you would say it was great. Yeah. You're into it. Yeah. It was okay. Fun. There it is. Yeah. There you're it into is. It. Okay. Okay. Yeah, that's funny. Yeah, okay. So then he drives you home. He drives me home and uh, walks me to my door and says goodnight. Uh -huh. And yeah, okay. And then he went in his car, and I went inside. Is that, is that uh, should he have tried to go inside, or should he not have just got the hell out of there? Oh no, we 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 said at the beginning. Oh, I was like, you're, you're not got coming it. inside. Got yeah, it. I uh, think it's better that way. I, mean, yeah. I think it, it ended the way it was needed to. Yeah. Okay. Well, Kevin told us a little bit about the goodbye. Would you like to <laughs> share your version? <laughs> What version did he share? Well, like, let's just hear yours first, and then we'll tell you his. Oh, my gosh. Like, how would you say the goodbye went? Like, like well. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I mean, he he got, he parked, mm -hmm. got out of the car. I could tell he was going to try and open the door for me. Uh-huh. And I opened it. Did he it. successfully? Okay, you did it. I did it. <laughs> and you could tell he kind of, like, looked down, and he was just kind of like, Ugh, like, it trying to do that like. yeah <laughs> <laughs> um walked me to my stairs and then uh gave me a kiss good night yeah and then uh that's when i was like nope pg-13 i was like yeah coming inside oh, interesting pg-13 date was yeah like, that's the exact words he used too actually was pg-13 yeah. yeah yeah except yeah, he, he tried to say pg and i was like i feel like it was a little bit more than pg and he was like yeah well, it's probably pg-13 he said it was a passionate kid. It kiss. It wasn't like a peck. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> yeah. So was, you would agree. <laughs> yeah. Okay. It was your own like fireworks for Fourth of July kiss. Is that what you're saying? Oh my god, I'm done. <laughs> um. Yeah. I there mean, it is. <laughs> okay. <laughs> yes. Okay. Yes. Uh. I mean. Yeah. Anytime. I feel like. Um. I don't know. There's history too. So it was like we haven't. You know. We used to talk. Funny story is. Uh, okay, so, like, my ex, the only guy I've ever dated for on and off 10 years, yeah. the only guy I've ever allowed to, like, call me his girlfriend, closest guy that came to it was Kevin. We Oof. talked for eight months. Yeah. Talked. Well, and 
we didn't share that part. So we didn't share that you guys had history. So we wanted to wait, like, for you to tell it, basically. So, yeah, so nobody knew that the state was with somebody that, like, there's kind of been history with, which I don't think probably we'll do in the future with other people because other ones it'll be, like, actual blind dates. But I feel like this one's kind of interesting because there is history. Oh, yeah. Yeah. And, and long gaps, right? Where it's like, eh, yeah. a year off, year off. Well, long. and you never actually have gone on a date together. No. Yeah. So it's, like, history, but there's, like, never been an actual cordial, like, dating time. And it's funny because he's asked me on a date here and there in between, too. It's always around July. Weird. It's super, yeah, it's like, I don't know. Because of like, your birthday? He's I like think thinking so. about it. I don't yeah. know. But Interesting. He always asks me, like, every two years. Mm-hmm. Like, he'll bring it up in conversation. Like, oh, let's go to dinner. Da, da, da. Yeah. And um, he's also the only dude that has met my dad oh, ever. Interesting. Uh-huh. Yeah, when I was DJing. Okay. By accident. That bomb bar, Cosmo. Yeah. 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 yeah, yeah. Met yeah. my dad. Um, yeah, Halloween too, weren't you? And then I was at yeah. Excess, I think, and then yeah, something. Oh. It was yeah. something. Going yeah, on. you guys yeah. were at no, you yeah. guys were at the Excess dressed up because when he showed up, he was in a costume. Yeah. My mm-hmm. mom had already left, and like my ex of like years hasn't even like no one's met him except for my old roommate Kate. Yeah. And Kevin, Kevin. made sure he made sure to run over there. Oh yeah. Meet him. He oh, made yeah. sure I was there. <laughs> I had a table full of all this stuff, and he just left. He said he had to go see Bree. Just slid my ticket across the table, and I said, sorry, guys, I got to see about a girl. <laughs> I got to go see about a girl? Yeah. That's what you said? I had. And they let you get away with that? Oh, yeah, they saw in my eyes, and I meant it. I'm bringing it back now. Uh, look at that support. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> okay, I love it. I'm ready to get into the questions, because I want to know. Yep. Okay, so th- did he give you the papers? Oh, yeah, yeah. okay, and then there's a Sharpie right there in front of you. <laughs> oh I'm more curious about what he said on this part. I know. I'm actually really excited for this reveal. It's going to be a great time. Okay. Wait. Oh, I'm so confused why it has a six on the back of it. I think I'm supposed to flip them. I don't think you got enough. Oh, no. I think you have two. One. Oh, yeah. Two. Oh, but you're, oh that's number two. Oh, for my side, it looks like it. Okay. Horrible boy handwriting. <laughs> Continuing on. Okay. So the first question is going to be, what was your first impression of the idea of a date with Kevin? Take your time. Take your time. No rush here. No yeah, because we can edit it. Yeah, make we're going to edit it anyways. So you'll yeah. be fine. Yeah. Right. Okay. Question yep. two. Here, you want me to hold it for you? Okay. Question two. Uh, what was your impression when you finally got together for the date? You said he wasn't matching. He looked like a. <laughs> <laughs> looked like he. F- yeah. Okay. Now number three. Oh my gosh! This is like terrible. Oh fuck. Okay, number three. What was something that happened on the date that was a red flag or a turn off? Um. Turn off. Turn off. I mean, if there was one, they could. Yeah, it could be nothing. Maybe he was great. I mean, there's always a red flag, though, isn't there? There has to be with Kevin. Yeah. Just kidding. (laughs) Okay. (laughs) Okay, number four. What was something that happened on the date that was a turn on? Um. Okay, now the um, fifth one is, was the sexual chemistry there for you, or were you as dry as the Sahara Desert? That's a good one. Was it an oasis or just a desert? Oasis or Sahara Desert. That's a tough one. That's a tough one to answer. Uh, Okay, so before I answer this one... I'm, like, very weird when it comes to that kind of stuff. Like, if I'm talking to someone, like, I'm only talking to one. Like, I don't talk to multiple people. I've always been that way. Yeah. Um, yeah, it could be, like, a sprinkly day in Las <laughs> Vegas. Or it could be a downpour. A light morning drizzle. There it is. Maybe the, uh, you know, pool uh, reference. Uh, high winds, umbrella down, 
ready and never comes. You know? I'm dead. I'm dead. You know what it is. Oh, so funny. Okay, cool. Sweet. And then the last question. Oh, no, we don't ask that until Kevin's here. Oh, got here. it, got it, got it. Okay, okay, so now <laughs> we need Kevin here. Kevin. Kevin! It sounded like Home Alone right there. I know it did. <laughs> Kevin! Oh, okay, gosh. cool. Man. All right. How bad was the destruction? Here, you right, I mean, it's great to hear two different sides, you know? It no, I'm is. living for this, and I yeah. can't wait till we're doing it with people on a blind date. It's going to be incredible. Especially people that don't know each other. Like, they're not going to care to hurt each other's feelings. So it's going to be great. This is good. <laughs> <laughs> this is fun. I like yeah. No, right? this is like so fun. I'm loving this. Okay. I like being right across from her, too. This is, uh, what's up, Bree? How you doing? Trust me, it's been a treat. Hi. Hello. Yeah. You look good. Thanks. Yeah. <laughs> Red Rock's finest again. Let's get into how, oh how God, epic sorry. this is that both of these show, these girls showed up here. Like, to think that this group could ever be in the same room, uh, to ke- for Kevin to pull this off, I mean, the only way we could get this group back in the same room is if probably for his funeral. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> That's the only way I ever thought we could get people. Wait, we hit. did it for his birthday one time. Did yeah, we? Did we? but that was by accident. No, yeah. I mean, like, you know, without, like, a massive party. Oh. Where you guys, these where you guys actually spoke. Yeah, we yeah. talked. <laughs> no, yeah. You had to actually look okay, at each other. Okay, but that cleared up some things today. She didn't even know I was at that party. Yeah. Hey, uh, let's I get no into it just a little bit for Owen in. Well, I'm well, excited real quick. Just <laughs> see, I haven't seen her since the date. Like, oh, this, is, this is nice. Yeah. That's what I'm saying. Let's just talk about how Ty, every time I seen, when I opened the door and you showed up, because I was already getting texts, how's mm-hmm. she looking? How's she looking? And I, you know, I didn't know what to say. Oh, I saw, uh, yeah, I saw, we were driving there and his phone kept going off and it was wazzy, wazzy, wazzy. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, a lot of you know, people are out. A lot of people yeah. wanted to know. I, w- I didn't even know until yesterday. He's like, oh, mm-hmm. guess what I did? And I was like, what? He was like, I went on a date. I was like, bitch, what are you talking about? I didn't so know how to I bring didn't it even up. Know. It was yeah, real I, mean, quick. I mean, how do you how do you beat these two? You, you know, don't. when I saw Ty come in and the outfit, and I got I got excited. You know, we've seen Ty a lot. You know, but she still brings that heat. You know, and then I haven't seen Brie. Every time I see Brie, I get more more impressed. <laughs> this is the ultimate you know? hype, man. Like I'm if I ever you. am feeling down, I text Waz. I'm telling you guys, it, it's, a lot of people wanted you guys in this room. And they want answers. Yeah, a lot of things. Did you get your your not boys all of chat it. going? Not all, well, yeah, I got that going. But we got a couple more questions. We still got to. Oh, get well, I know. I know. I can get rambling sometimes, yeah. and I enjoyed that. I get to just shut the fuck up when Corey's around, and I don't have to say a <laughs> damn word. Yeah, and I mean, Ty of of all people really enjoys it because I don't I don't I don't speak and Corey does all the talking. Yeah, there's a lot of you know there's a lot of history here with uh, let's just throw, uh, actually get into the date stuff and we'll throw in other okay. stuff later. I love okay, it. okay, let's go we'll with question a, number one question reveal. Round when it's I'm over. nervous. Okay, <laughs> I'm nervous too, but I love it. Okay, wait, real quick before you do it, I was so confident like as I'm doing the my review. Yeah. And then as I was, and I was sitting over there with the headphone, I didn't, couldn't hear a word. Yeah. I was like, this, I don't know what the fuck's happening in there. This yeah. could go real bad. <laughs> I am yeah. living for this episode. Right, I'm, I'm gonna, so excited. I got a, I got a theory. Can't wait for Kevin. you to watch it, honestly. Okay, let's do number one. What was your first impression of the idea of a date? Let's reveal. Uh, I think just kind of show it to this, Brie. Oh. Ooh, I like that. Okay, you were exci- Kevin was excited to Positivity. finally do it. Positivity. Brie thought it was going to be fun. Thanks. So yeah, this did you was... think that he might be funny on this date a little bit more? <laughs> yeah, like... did we think he's funny now? Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> did, uh, did he did he get, get any good jokes, or was it all that terrible bar humor he brought it back to you again? All right, so <laughs> you know when I first got out of my long ten whatever year relationship, I, those jokes were not funny to me. I, I was just like, "You're corny." Yeah, <laughs> he yeah. is very corny. Super, though. but yeah. then when you get I know said it earlier. You learn yeah. his humor, and y- and then you're into funny. it more. Yeah. yeah, in his own Kevin funny way. How. Exactly. Funny how? Funny how? Cue, cue that. Cue that. Like part. I amuse you. Yeah. Well, I'm funny how? I mean, funny like I'm a clown. I amuse you. I make you laugh. I'm here to fucking amuse you. What do you mean funny? Funny how? How am I funny? <laughs> what am I, a fucking clown or something? Oh, oh, what's up, there we Ty? Go. There we go. <laughs> I love that it. fucking You've scene. You've seen it. Oh, classic. Okay. <laughs> okay. Right, I'm one for one. Damn. Number two. Yes. What was your impression when you finally got together for the date? <laughs> Here we go. I'm done. <laughs> Uh, okay, yeah. saw the effort she put in, which is always good to see. Yeah, we did discuss your outfit, Kevin. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, that's fine. 
<laughs> a lot of people saying she not said you matching. Don't match. <laughs> you didn't match. But was it the cool? Was it the fair. cool like uh, rapper not match? Like I'm gonna wear some. Uh... No. no. Come on, I had some fly. I had some fly Nikes on. Ooh. Yeah, but you got to get the colors to match. <laughs> She's very specific with that. I was like I said, I was gonna go with the gray shirt, and I said, you know what, fuck it, I'm gonna throw a wrench in it. And I'm gonna go. You want to know what? She gave you the benefit of the doubt and was like, maybe because it's a holiday, he like thought he was doing Fourth of July theme. And- oh duh. But you weren't. You just went <laughs> I didn't want to tell you that. Yeah, okay. My underwear <laughs> were. Don't take her. My underwear was excuse. red. Yep. And then my American socks. Flag. Green and blue. My, red, green, and blue. But my underwear was and red, us. and then the socks were white. But we didn't get that far because we kept it classy. Yeah. Wait, why? Why did you get the green? Yeah. You could have gone with black. Like Green for money. That? Thank you. Black. <laughs> that's what it. Shut up. Okay, you can put that one down. Okay, number three. What oh, I'm excited for this one. What was something that happened on the date that was a red flag or a turn off? Ooh. Oh boy. <laughs> yeah. Not matching, exactly. Oh, there it Can't is. Reach oh. for the bill. Yeah. It's the Didn't first date after seven I agree. years. <laughs> and here it is. What do you want to go? Do you want to elaborate? She probably elaborated. Yeah, I mean, he he enough. was looking at that last name and saying, Hey, you know, I figured this is a, this is just a, a drop in the so, elaborate, uh, yeah. I'll elaborate <laughs> just in the fact of I I don't expect the woman to pay ever, but it's just about the uh, or move that a little to your right, Marie, just because of that camera. Um, I expect just the reach, you know, the fake reach. You know, everyone, you know how it is. You go Why to the be wallet. phony though. It would have been phony because normally Thank I would have reached for it, but I know that you knew. We even talked about this where I was like, "I'm grading you." Like, God, I was getting everything hostile. Was yeah. getting, everything was getting everything was getting graded. And it's phony, so it's like, why would I so reach? Why if it's would I? Be phony? Why would I reach? Normally I would because it's like, Thank oh, you. it's that awkward. Like, oh, we can go have these, or I can like whatever. Yeah. Like, but I already she knew. was grading you. All right, I had to come up with something, and that was just something that I thought <laughs> I expected it's not her burn them down over here. Over here. I, Yikes. I expected her to do that. The just means he literally had nothing else. Okay. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's just, I really didn't. Okay, beautiful. Number four, what was something that happened on the date that was a turn on? Mm. Mm. Ooh, okay. Oh, okay. oh, yeah. I didn't His know that was going on. from the last seven years, me either. <laughs> was that like a Weekend at Bernie style? <laughs> it was, yeah. Or was yeah. it like La Fonda and what's it, Kip from Napoleon? Okay, it wasn't, but his, technically your hand was just tickling my kneecap and it was well the legs like accident it wasn't even i just put footsie i didn't know how to put it on a i would have taken like two paragraphs like our legs like accidentally like touched but then neither one of us like decided it was more of like then we got closer because you know we're in a big booth and it was and there's my memory again as you said or i remember it and then like we we (laughs) went from Social distancing to <laughs> right next Wait, to so each other. Wait, so were you sitting across from each other? Or next no, it was to a each booth, other? and we were kind of um, like on the inside. So yeah, we yeah. could have sat on separate sides, but we Ew, were no. we were like inside. <laughs> That's not good. If a guy sits that far away, Wait, from hold me, on. I'm leaving. It wasn't like real quick. It wasn't like <laughs> two separate like the booth where I'm. I would never sit next to you if I can sit across from you. It was like a. It was kind of like this, and we decided to sit like there. Next to each other. But then, yeah, the legs like touched, and neither, I don't think at least. Was it smooth? Was it smooth? I mean, let her decide that. (laughs) Smooth, like, like, no, I mean, was the skin smooth? Oh, this, of course. Yeah, just like, yeah. I thought you were saying the move. See, I thought the same thing. No, very. Now, what about She knows what she's doing, though. She handles all that. Well, it's a date. Very manicured. Um, (laughs) So, (laughs) what about his memory? Get into um, your answer. Just every little detail. Like that he remembers the from the last seven years? Yeah. Okay. Like every single little detail. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Okay. Like, okay. That means it meant something. It, it did. Wow, yeah, look we, at that. And then he even had to bring up the phone and the number thing. He was like, I just want to let you know. We're driving there. He I saved told, your number? Yeah. He was oh. like, I, I saved your number. It's seven years. I would <laughs> fucking hope so. She's in there. Wow. <laughs> Congrats. She's in You're there. You're doing great, sweetie. Okay. <laughs> number five. <laughs> what was the sexual chemistry there or was the sexual chemistry there for you or not like so we said oasis or dry as this <laughs> yeah so for you would be uh blue chew heavy, heavy chemistry i'm okay. a lady <laughs> light morning light drizzle morning. Yeah. Okay, there we go. thank yeah. you yes I love that's good that's good you, that's a good okay, no, you have to answer oasis umbrellas down umbrellas light down. morning drizzle that's way better yeah i would have said or um sahara desert um like the wetlands <laughs> 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 no uh 
I would say more than a light morning. We, I think we we talked at some. Here's my memory just coming back again. Oh my god, there where he goes. we stroke disease. Th- there was, never gonna let it go. <laughs> He's not. There was something we talked about how there was like light and heavy, and I thought we had heavy Oof. chemistry. Mm. And she's not going to elaborate on what we were talking about. but I don't think anybody <laughs> needs to. Okay. I think we get the vibe. Now we're going to answer number six. Okay. You this guys is ready? fun. I like being the guest. There's a lot less pressure. <laughs> it's way more fun to be the interviewer. <laughs> I'm living for it. Okay. It's just cool to be on the side. So number six. Oh, no. The final question for both of you Ooh, is, big. do you want to leave it in or do you want to pull out? Oh, good writing. That's pretty good. Do you want to? Describe what that it means to yeah, the Yeah, so it means like, would you be open to another date or do you want to pull out of it? So leaving it in is Leaving it in date. is like being like, I might be willing to like scope this I out a little commit longer. To this. Yeah, it'd be like. Not c- commit because we don't know, you don't like that word, but you would be open to like continually further, like maybe <laughs> a second date or not, or you pull out. Or I'm just pulling out. Yeah, it. uh, it'd basically be like uh, cabana cream or cabana cream pie. <laughs> <laughs> no, because cream's still cream. Yeah, but if you, go, you know, it's pulling out. If you're just cabana, yeah. you could, or you you could pull out. Cream and, you could co- pull out and you know walk away and do it at home when it went terrible, you know. Or other places, yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> okay. Let's Welcome to the cabana cream pie show. <laughs> this is big. This is a big moment. It's already oh, okay. Okay, no. let's answer. Oh <laughs> uh, yeah, it's complicated. Oh, okay, pull, it oh, up. pull out. Okay, okay. This Ooh. has got interesting. Yeah, it is. Okay, let's get. I into want to it. go to her first. Oh. I answered no, no, every no, no, other no, one. No. I answered every other one first. No, 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 no. No, because I I think there's meaning behind my answer. Not that yours isn't. <laughs> I think there's meaning Wait. behind her answer since it's yeah. complicated. It's complicated. Well, mine. I think I had the more of an asshole answer because you took you took a fucking a little scapegoat she took a there little in between <laughs> in between route. Okay, let's so hear. Bri, I'd like. Well, I kind of knew that was coming though, but continue. As the us. guest of my house, I'd like you to go first. You know, I'm a good uh, host. He's a gentleman. Oh he's a gentleman. You open the door first. You let the lady first, right? Uh, the lady first. Uh, mm-hmm. It's complicated. complicated. Uh, I have. A very high demanding, time consuming job um, where I work twenty four seven. I sell Aether Gardens. I know. Uh, Shout out dispensaries. Shout out dispensaries. Um, and I'm constantly working seven days a week, um, and just don't really have time for anything more. Yeah. Then yeah, especially right now. And so I'm if moving. it w- if that wasn't the case, then that's why you say it's complicated. Because if that yeah. wasn't the case, you would be more open to it. Um. Yeah. I mean, it's it was it was really fun. It, I had a great time. He put in a lot of effort. Um, I'm really close with like you know we go way back. Uh, mm-hmm. But going back on the conversations both of us had previously of just like what we're both very picky. We don't want to like waste any more time of anyone's like yeah what he's looking for and what he's like waiting for. You know for his perfect girl <laughs> yeah you know to, to really just oh uh, and we have to have a conversation about what he doesn't because that i brought that up so please, many times because i was just about to mention so it, but I many to times. Get into it. <laughs> thank you let's get yeah. into it i would love to hear about it yeah because you definitely have to because it yeah. i just can't so that's yeah. probably a turn off oh uh, yeah i mean that that has to be um Kevin. That is a factor in any, like, I 100% Decision agree. Making. Yeah, yeah. 100%. That you. definitely comes into play. Yes. Also, yes. just, you know, at the same type of the things that he used to say, you know, once enough p- time goes by, it's either you're going one way, you're going, or the other way. Yeah, for and sure. once you go the other way, it's, yeah, it's, you guys always be flirty and, like, friends, yeah. but, like, you guys went the other way. Yeah. When he comes to a crossroads... And he's got to decide. If he goes one way, he can continue what he's doing and be with any girl who will have him. And if he goes the other way, he gets to be with only one woman, maybe for the rest of his life. And by you guys, you mean you and I? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay. No, how weird. long? How long we got? I got. A, I got an essay for this. I got okay. a whole. Uh, a time limit. I got a big one. I got a filibuster. Well, the sun's on this. playing an hour, so I need you to <laughs> give me the clip. Notes. Um. Over. Well, if, Bree, I got a applaud you i think you touched on a lot of why i said pull out um i don't want to waste her time Mm -hmm. because maybe like years ago there wasn't really the guilt i was younger then 
mm-hmm. and uh, there wasn't a guilt either because we were just young kids running around. Um, you're doing very well in your career, and I see like a very bright future, and I just see me fucking that up. Look at this oh, stand up man answer hey, from uh, time, just from like basic standpoint, like. Then now you're looking at time spent with me and we're doing this, we're going there. You do the Cali vacation and then you're going here and there. You know how Corey knows mm-hmm. how it goes. We know mm-hmm. how the steps go. Yeah. Um, and I don't want to do that as well as from an emotion. Like I'm, I'm, I know I'm difficult to deal with. So I don't, mm-hmm. when you could be like focused on your work and focused on furthering yeah. your Instead career. Your and your, bullshit. And yeah. St- yeah, you yeah. said that. And st- yeah, and I don't <laughs> want you like staying up late or waking up early like because of me you just like your own you're just still it's just your non-committalness still because you're just like looking for doing you i'm just having a good time yeah Yeah. i know and from a rated nc-17 pulling out's always just way more fun like to oh my god, my I'm not even getting into this <laughs> view. All I these can't other, even get into all these other, Kevin's method of all these other, sex no, anymore. all these other fucking pussies here that I, my buddies <laughs> that I talk to, that all want to leave it in and all that, and because it feels Kevin, better. Uh, that's did we bullshit. even touch on you uh, on how you come when you have sex? We haven't touched. <laughs> yeah, on what, this. what's going on? We got wait, into what that. On? <laughs> wait, what are you talking about? <laughs> <laughs> Jesus Christ, mother, turn the turn the show off at this point. Literally, what are we? Wait, what, I don't know what I've said. What are we talking about? About how you literally will still not come inside a girl, even if you're wearing a condom. <laughs> well, I'd, if if I, all right, now we're, we're uh, really detailed. If 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 the condom's on, like, and I and I finish in it, to me it was like a waste. Like I'm like not a waste. That's r- wrong wording, but like. But you like to pull out and then take the condom off and then come. Yeah. Yeah, I think that is so fucking weird. everywhere. Like as a release, <laughs> <laughs> it's like a release. I fucking cannot. It's healthy, and yeah, then I it's don't have healthy. To, I don't have to worry about the month. Uh, Does that not seem like a lot in the process? No, it's not a process. No, I'm not asking you. <laughs> as a female, like that seems like if a guy was doing, I'd be like, God, this just is a lot going on right now. Yeah, it is a process. Yeah, yeah. I'm just gonna say yeah. His, yeah. his process is a process. Yeah. Man. I just uh, I don't. It's more of I don't want to hear like the month later than I'm worried about getting that text. That hey, late you're wearing text. a condom. Okay. Tell all these kids that were accidentally born that now we're getting way too deep in this. But basically, I don't want to deal. Thank you. I don't want to deal with the stress <laughs> no the sense. next for the next month. He literally thinks people are out here poking holes in condoms <laughs> where they have sex with him because he's such a catch. Everyone wants are to you have his sh- fucking baby. I never she's saying that. That's her speaking. <laughs> I just I feel like that's that. where your head's at. Like you are so worried about a condom breaking and getting somebody pregnant that you just like don't even trust. Their, you have such commitment issues that you don't even trust your condoms. I don't. <laughs> Hey, it's only what what is it ninety percent or some shit? Yeah, right. Look at the stats. We, we grew up with like porno though, like porno they pulled out and you know in the. Okay, 90s. but I know that you're now, not doing that. No, he, he definitely has the commitment. Should we t- bring up my rule? <laughs> yeah, bring Don't up that rule. I need shit. it. Go I ahead. It. What's the so rule? like when we were talking, I was very easy going. I was like, I don't just don't lie to me. Mm-hmm. And like I just have a twenty four hour rule. Like, yeah, just don't if have you, sex with me and then go or um, have sex Vice with someone versa. else. Yeah. And then 24 hours, have sex with me. Like, that was That's my only rule. rule. Yeah. I didn't care if you do you. Yeah. Rap, you know, I, I he was safe. You already know his process. Yeah. yeah. So you knew that was fine. And he couldn't even do that. Yeah, oh, but that's, that, that, that wow. will hold. Damn. <laughs> But Here let's say this, go. let's say this, though. If you do have the 24-hour rule. How did you, you find out? I want more. Oh, you God. want him wearing a condom, right? He's If he's filling everybody up and then he's coming I, then over. My issue isn't the condom part. My issue is the process of coming. Because I'm saying, like, if a girl is about to get off at the same fucking time and then you have to pull out and do this whole thing, it's like, what the fuck? Yeah, but what if you just, like, wait you another minute? Well, again, dead. Ty, that's when you're making love. Yeah, you're making love. Again, no, it's not. It's that <laughs> you're trying to get off or you're trying not to get off. Like, oh, don't you want the girl to get off, too? I do. Okay, so you're I'm all about her getting her. off, and then no, I can not. get off at the end. And but let what it, if she's like about to said, get like, off at the same time? Like, Corey, like, growing up on porn, like, let it go the right that's way. That's how it always ended. Yeah, it's just it's it's better mentally. Like it's, yeah, that's like, it just feel better. It's just a better release. It's the ending to the scene. He's right, you know. And then God, you turn the person the, I mean, that ends up actually right. dating Kevin, it's gonna yeah. be wild. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Your first girlfriend's going to 
What about the oral? She's going to... Let's get into the oral tie. You always get riled up about that. You know, is there, yeah, is I'm that literally, ever an issue? Yeah, so she did say it, and it was an issue. Oh, yeah. yeah. We, brought, we brought it up. You I brought was, it up? He, uh, I even forgot. We did have a conversation about it when we were talking. Uh, and ooh. what was his line of why he doesn't do it? It's funny because we... <laughs> We have to bring up the Red Rock. So when he, there I first met him at Red Rock, uh-huh. somehow that conversation got brought up. And I was like, I, I don't like, somehow like sucking dick came up. And I was just like, that's <laughs> like, I don't really, like, that's no, oh, I'm, okay, I'm good on that. It. Like, yeah, mind you, I'm like, you know, 19, 20, whatever. Yeah. And with you was our bosses at the times, twin brothers. I'm like, oh my God, like trying to stay, you know, PG. Innocent. Yeah. yeah. I think the tongue ring throws people off. It, it does. It definitely does. Because that's, that's it does. straight to our head. It's like, for oh God, sure. here we go. It does. <laughs> yeah. yeah. But it's, it's for, so I don't bite on my cheeks. Instead, I oh, like okay. mm-hmm. play with your tongue. Mm-hmm. Okay, interesting. Yeah. Okay. So, hey, I'm learning, man. Yeah, yeah no good. one's ever told me that angle. Okay. Yeah, so I don't bite my cheeks. Every girl I know has it for a second dick. So that's why I was like, okay, I've never heard oh, yeah. another angle. <laughs> and okay. um, I, uh, yeah, I didn't, that whole conversation got brought up at the pool, yada, yada, yada. And then, so when we're talking 2016 or whatever, yeah, I noticed, you know, that he never went and did that. They he noticed. Went, I, see, I, the, I was told Corey, I was like, I don't think they care. <laughs> they do. <laughs> they care? do. Did this is why I told yeah. you they yeah. fucking care. Were you yeah. like, what the fuck's this guy doing? Is he ever going to? Be trying to throw it in his face and be like, "Get over here, God damn it!" I no? actually didn't mind back then, <laughs> yeah, because like I was twenty two, yeah, yeah. and like I had previously been like that, so I was like, "Oh, I'm gonna respect that." Yeah, but then it's like, "All right, we've been talking for like seven, eight months, however long we were talking, and then like it was just like it gets weird." Yeah. What if it was now when you guys were going, and then he wasn't doing it now? Did then you, it's even. Oh, it wouldn't. Like, it wouldn't have lasted seven yeah. months. Would you have just been like, exactly. "I'm out of here, fuck it." Yeah. Okay. Like, yeah. Yes. These are questions that the people want to know. Oh they my ask, god! I'm they so glad answers. because I knew I yeah. was right. Ever since him, like I no, no. Nah. Okay. Like if they don't go, if they don't try things, I don't try things. They don't. They don't do. They, yes, but this is exactly they do it my right point. Because yeah. you saw what I said. I was like, how do you expect somebody to suck your dick at phenomenally, but then you're not even reciprocating? What like that. What if you don't expect mind. them to suck though? You definitely do. What guy doesn't? I mean, maybe they're premature ejaculate. It's not that I know anything about it. You know what I mean? But maybe they are. But uh, even those so, ones still want it. So would you say now if they don't like? Do you like to start with that? No, it's there? just any guy. I, I've not this issue. Yeah. Normally they Since go for Kevin. it. Yeah, like it, they but they go you, for it. Do you yes. enjoy it when they do it, or because uh, we've talked to a lot of girls and they don't they don't like it for some reason. I think that is so weird. I don't like it too early. Like I don't like it. Like first first time like we kiss, first time jumping in. But yeah. The only once guy, you've like hung out. Yeah. Like yes. there's like a good then time. You're more frame. Into it's it. like the it's second more intimate. time, second time, you know, you second guys are time. hanging out. Second time. Yeah. yeah. Go for it on the second time. We just won't but get they there. always we just like go, go for it like second. straight Never away. Yes, I know. I think it's so weird when they don't. I like I'm actually like pushing them off. Like, wait, it wasn't the second time yet. Like it wasn't the second time. <laughs> exactly. just bad. It's just bad. Bad. I feel like Good. every guy I know is into it except Kevin. Yeah. Uh, fuck, man. Here we go again. Just, uh, just destruction. We didn't know. We didn't know this. I, whole, I'm I didn't know so this glad we had this confirmed because they've like always been like, no, we know so many girls. I'm like, bitch, no. We were just talking to a girl from OnlyFans. Uh, what was that Sunday? Yeah, our and girl. she was saying that. She was like, nah. It, what, she actually, yeah. So I was like, you know, we and her were talking, whatever, just talking casually, and she. Uh, She's like, I watched your show uh, and gave me a huge high five and was like, I fucking know, like, I don't want guys doing that to me either. Like, I don't even, I don't need it. I don't want that. Okay, here's my theory on girls that don't like it. I think that it has to do with them feeling, and I, no offense to whoever was that said this, and I'm no shade, but for me, no shot. As a She's female, got a great vagina. Yeah. Okay. No shot. Not, I don't know this, she but I just, it. no, yeah, but I, it doesn't have to do with it. her <laughs> vagina. I think it has to just do with like, there's some part of them that's like, insecure about maybe it's not their vagina but like sexual past or something like i feel like it plays into some sort of trauma and why they don't like it okay could be like a deeper rooted thing i think it's i don't know i don't really know but yeah Yeah. it's it's like maybe it's like too personal yeah like it's too close for comfort for them or something like a fuck is just a fuck but yeah that's like too more when you can't uh spurt out they say the girls get too too riled up and they stop you know, they don't let themselves go there. Enjoy it, yeah. yeah. Okay. I think they get too like in their own release, head. Like, yeah. Yeah. Mm-hmm. I think when it comes, like, for me and Brie, I, I didn't 
I never knew that at the th- again, maybe it's because she was younger at the time. I didn't know that that was ever even thought of. You I never just thought it. think you we would just all you just get. You think you know, this about every girl that you've just, had you this know, interaction you just, with? You start, you know, you start foreplay, and then you get down to it. That things are going on, and then doesn't just it doesn't really seem like get it's ever wanted it. or or warranted. Uh, warranted. Well, that's you, fucked up. Wanted. But okay, so do you think a girl just thinks that about you not wanting your dick suck? <laughs> this is what I mean, like. How I mean, they stupid all, is that? None of them have really, like, not wanted to do it. It kind of happens. Because that's just what you do when you're sexually active with somebody. You just do all these acts of sexuality with them. So it's weird that you're holding out on the one. Here's yeah. the thing. It's just, at this point. you 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 get like to, cre- you know, you're a very creative person. <laughs> so uh, that falls with you in every category of your life. You really like, you know, the the real. <laughs> well, I don't yeah, know, I don't know, what know about that. Creative. Wait, what are like, you saying? He loves like the creativeness, passion. The, wheel, yada, yada, the wheelbarrow, yada. like the wheelbarrow and stuff. <laughs> <laughs> Is that what he's, he's breaking out new positions and shit. No, American but... Psycho style. What's he doing over here? <laughs> <laughs> the lady. The lady. He just. He yeah. likes you know to move around a lot. And so he's not track. just laying there dead. Yeah, like he's yeah. you know. Switch, yeah, so you switch, would think he would switch. like toss yes, that in exactly. there. Exactly. Exactly. I mean, it's comes up where I've wanted to at times. So again, it, it has happened mm. where I know that it's See it's that? not that I don't want to do this. Like I yeah, like now the, it's an ego. Thing. I like vagina, like Jesus Christ. No, I know you do, but that's but why it's, it's even weirder. It's like an urban legend thing. It, now <laughs> it's just it like not, it's not helping your cause. Well, it's just funny at urban this point. Legend. It's like it's kind of like an urban legend type thing where it's like now it doesn't happen, and now the first that time it happens, like. I don't want it to just be like the rando at the club. It, it should just be like. But somebody you talk I to just for eight it's months. not easy. So you're going to have so much catching up to this do. This is what I told him. I was like, like, you literally need to get going it's because not, it's not going to be your wife because she's it, not going to want to deal with it. Like, yeah. you need to be start getting there. <laughs> Like, it's a process. There's a lot of different. There's a spots. reason why guys there's are a lot good of at it. You know, yes. you gotta do a lot. Like it's not just an easy. Ooh, like you don't just like go into it. Yeah, but, fucking yeah, but I knowing think, what you're doing. I think oral. The, the, on who a girl. you see me out when we were 21 and who eats me out now are completely two different people. 110. <laughs> so like I'm just saying, you gotta get that shit on you. How you used to fuck when you were young the and alphabet. how you fuck now is different. Be the alphabet, yeah. right? It's practice. So I need practice. Yeah, you need practice. All right. Shut up. All right, uh, Bree, let's go work on it then. <laughs> yeah. yes. I fucking knew that was yes. coming. I think we got it. As soon I as I saw your face, I know. It, the wheels landed. were turning. We're gonna have to wrap this up. This is going. Connected. This is gonna it's be It's funny too because you you do have a facial expression like when you think of something really good and you're like, oh my god, yes. I the light bulb. Get this. Yeah, <laughs> it is, and you can see it on your face. Yep. Bing. That's a good. Oh wow, this is great. I mean, just seeing Bree in the flesh, like after the the date, and I'm just you know. Yeah. So we so I'm we're gonna a type of way. we covered all this. All right, you, you're too busy work. You don't want to fuck it up. But is it good for like a uh, a late night booty call? Uh, you know, fuck session late at night. Would that be good, or or do you not want that anymore? Um, I feel like that's outdated for you guys. It's yeah, for me, it's way outdated. It's like Damn. if I'm giving anyone my time, it's like yeah. they need to like. Right time now. is literally money. Yeah. yeah. So yeah. it's it's like if you, if you're not yeah no I don't really do that. You're not legit then. None no. of that. No, I feel like there you guys have that. had that seven year like yeah. duration and now it's like kind of like okay Damn. what the fuck are we doing here? Looks yeah. Like, looks like my night freed up. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. There, there goes gonna, that. There goes the night point. I'm gonna hear what the fans say and we'll, yeah we're gonna if, get the if you guys need this. me to start chipping away at this I'm game. Little red rock. But uh, if I need to just. Go and watch the game and kick it and do my own thing and edit my videos and I can do that too. So either is. way, I'm there a happy. Is. Either way, I'm a happy guy. <laughs> I'm gonna yeah. be all right. There it is. Oh, we man. know this. Yeah. Man, oh, oh, man, oh man, we're tying it all. Ty's pearl of wisdom. What do we got? Let's oh, end this. What is my pearl of wisdom today? Shit, we've covered so much. Yeah. Um, honestly. I think my pearl of wisdom is like staying true to yourself. Like I liked her answer a lot because it would be easy because you have history together to be like, oh yeah, like I'm willing to give it a try. But I think that just shows like how much growth has happened between like the two of you individually to both give the answers that you guys gave because probably a few years ago would have been like, eh, we can fuck around for a little longer, see what happens. But I liked that everybody was like, it's true awesome. to themselves. Yeah. Bree's so grown now; it scares me, and I'm so and I'm, I'm and this is why you're scared. I'm so no, I'm so like proud of like the woman you're becoming, and I, mean, I don't see I, the, I don't now. see Jordans on. I don't see nothing. It's changed. Yeah. Everything's changed over here. You grew up on us. 
All right. know, Blue Chew. Wait, 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 before we end, we got a couple fan questions we still got to throw out there oh, for because of Red Rock, you know, and all this oh, stuff. Okay. Um, yeah. Let's go. Up. We'll put this on the story. So first go off, for it. First off, before we get out of here, uh, <laughs> this was sponsored by Blue Chew, which is an actual, <laughs> this whole thing was paid for by Blue Chew. Thank so you, Blue act, Chew, for yes, supporting. Yes. What do you guys think? So it comes, it's Viagra that you chew before, uh, and you can get it through an actual doctor. It's not like an offshore lab where they're, uh, you know. It's fucking giving you a heart attack or something. Real shit. So if you're banging a guy and you find out he's popping blue chew, are you disappointed? Yes. Very? For sure. For my is it age. A, is it uh, for how for old age. I, yeah. 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 Like, is it a, uh, you know. is it a, uh, uh, like a, like a, like a game changer? Uh, like, uh, yeah. Like, uh, wait, but is I'll, it I guarantee the both of your guys, or is it the third I think fuck? both your guys are doing it. That's Either way, if it's the first or third, <laughs> I'm out. If it's, oh, there it is. Well, there here's the reason, because I say that because Kevin <laughs> has experimented with it. But it was after a long bender of fucking. Yeah, so because he took it's it not, as assistant. Yeah, because it's not like a it's not like an old person's thing anymore. Like these kids, I, these lifeguards are. They're ruining for it. their dicks over it though. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not I literally know are. a guy that literally ruined his dick because he used to take shit when he was younger, like the gas station shit. Because he so thought that was a good idea. That, but you've never experienced having sex high. No. Well, so here it is. Like, I was that wait, is so much more. I was a test subject for for it, and yeah. why was that? That is a celibacy thing during the... Uh, no, but you're, you're the married friends. I gave it to the married friends. They they always came back and said they weren't fucking using it. So I never... Even, and that was another... Married friends don't fuck I've never, but I've I don't never, find that real. I gave but it to then I'm like, I they just hate each everybody. other that much. Yeah, that, yeah. I've never wanted to take any of that stuff, but Corey got a bunch from a source he knows, <laughs> and he gave it to all of his married friends yeah, to, it around, like to do it. And just give their like review on it, mm -hmm. and none of them would do it. So he knew I was. What? How did you describe that I was about to go do? You were on a bender, a, a, a fuck bender, basically. Yeah. And so he uh, was. I was like, all right, I, I'm the last day. I'll take it and just see if I notice anything. And yeah. that's yeah. I mean, I don't. I don't know. It, it was the same. I would say, but I think it was a bad, I was, I was, you know, <laughs> I'm like, th I'm like three days. Go. I was like three days in. I was, I was full of nothing. Yeah. I was dry as the Sahara, Sahara Desert, Desert, as you say at that point. <laughs> That's over with. Blue Chew. What else we got? Oh, yeah. Red Rock Manager. Who was the best one? Danny Lianos. Oh. See, I didn't, yeah. work, I didn't work with him closely quick. enough. That was yeah. good for you. That's good. High five on that. <laughs> that I was like real that. quick. That was, that was good. Dang. A lot of people wanted to know that one. She's so not wrong. I, that's, why, that's the only reason we went to we it. Love, he was there. We love you know? the guy, man. Love the guy. Friend, friend of the program. Those were the good old days there. I remember. Big friend of the program. Uh, when I was bar backing, I was throwing a fit about taking out the trash to A-Rod. And yeah. A-Rod was like, Bree, you're taking out this fucking trash. And I went to Danny. <laughs> I was like, Danny. <laughs> and he was making me. And he was like, all right, Bree. He picked up the trash. And he was like, come on, Bree. We're going to take it out together. <laughs> like, <laughs> you're like, okay, that's all right. A, let's do that. I think I've seen a let's picture. I think I've seen a picture of that. Actually. Yep. Yeah, that and A-Rod was mad for like months loki he would just he never let it go he's like at least take out the trash <laughs> he never let it go See that? what about uh, yours ty uh, did she answer yeah but I, like when i got there they were phasing out of there so i wasn't yeah. really working with them like as closely as they used he to went be there. inside the after our first summer so he was rarely out there yeah i think i saw him like twice yeah okay uh. Yeah, so and then that and then that season we had like seventeen different managers. Oh my gosh, and I hated them all. <laughs> they were a shit show. And Not it's into still them. a shit I like show. The Here we are, six years later. It's still a shit show. There. They had some good lifeguards there, though, right? Oh, <laughs> yeah, God. yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, Maybe when we I mean, were young. They, yeah, they had some. They had some good ones. I heard. Mm. Yeah. Interesting. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's what we heard. All right, that's uh, all I got. This is it. That was it. Send us home, Ty. I started us. You send us home. All right. Um, I guess I can pan to both. Thank you so much for tuning in to episode three. This is this actually might be episode three and four. I'm gonna be honest with you. Oh. We're gonna probably do this yeah. as, a, a as a two parter okay. because I don't want to short overwhelm. How well I don't want to overwhelm. I also don't want to short like everything that Bree said. I'd like her to have her own episode because she deserves it. Yeah, can okay. I get can I get a well, copy your of that? episode? Your segment was much longer, so yeah, you should yeah. just do a separate. <laughs> send, send me the uncensored for real. Version. We will. All yeah. right, thank you so much, and Cabana Cream Show. We are out. See you next time. Thank you, everybody. Bye. Boom. Bye.